Welcome to Align Christ-Centered Yoga. My name is Linda and I'll be guiding our practice today. Today will be a 30-minute memory verse flow. We'll be connecting scripture with breath and movement. And today will be a strength building practice. So do whatever you can and um, take breaks when you need to or adjust the poses when you need to. Our scripture verse today is from the book of Joshua. And the Lord says to his people, have I not commanded you? Be strong and courageous. Do not be afraid. Do not be discouraged. For the Lord your God will be with you wherever you go. As God gives the people this encouragement, he is asking them to change everything. He is asking them to move into an unknown land, to enter into battles for that land. He is asking them to redefine the way that they live their lives. So where is it right now that God is asking you to be strong and courageous? Anchor your sitting bones into a prop or the mat. Begin to find your breath. As you inhale, breathe down the body. Inhale into the lungs, the rib cage, the diaphragm muscle. And exhale up. Can you breathe three dimensionally? Breathing into the back of the body as well as the front. Breathing side to side. Checking in physically, where do you feel weak? Upper body, lower body, core. Just noticing. Checking in mentally, energetically. What are the weaknesses there? And checking in spiritually. Where does your faith need to grow? Have I not commanded you? Be strong and courageous. Do not be afraid. Do not be discouraged. For the Lord your God goes with you wherever you go. Begin to connect movement with breath, bringing the arms up and overhead with the inhale. Exhaling, bring the hands down. Continue here. On that next inhale, let the gaze rise. And as the arms come down, bow your head. And add the scripture verse. Have I not commanded you? Be strong and courageous. Do not be afraid. Do not be discouraged. For the Lord, your God, will be with you wherever you go. Go ahead and come off the block. And if you have props, bring them to the front edge of the mat. Meet me in table. Let's just warm up the back a bit, find cat and cow. Connecting with breath, exhale into that cat. Inhale to cow. Add the scripture verse. Have I not commanded you? Be strong and courageous. Do not be afraid. Do not be discouraged. For the Lord, your God, will be with you wherever you go. Meet me at table. Bring the right arm forward, the left leg extended, 
exhale into a crunch, inhale, extend. Continue here. Have I not commanded you? Be strong and courageous. Do not be afraid. Do not be discouraged. For the Lord, your God, will be with you wherever you go. Meet me back in table. Come to child. Stay in child for a breath. Surrendering into wherever it is that God is calling you. And rise back to a strong table, this time extending left arms and right leg. Exhaling in, crunch. Inhale, extend. Add the verse. Have I not commanded you? Be strong and courageous. Do not be afraid. Do not be discouraged. For the Lord, your God, will be with you wherever you go. Meet me in table and come back to child. Come forward, come to a kneeling plank. And if you're feeling strong today, come to a straight leg plank. And then come all the way down to the mat. Come into a cobra. Keep it low, engage through the abdominals, let the shoulders drop back towards the hips. And then curling the toes under, bring the knees into your rib cage, ribs to thighs, find that first downward facing dog today, shake your head out, no and yes. Forward into plank. Down to the mat. Back bend. Downward facing dog. Plank. Have I not commanded you to the mat? Be strong and courageous. Back bend. Do not be discouraged. Downward facing dog and stay there. Do not be afraid. For the Lord your God is with you wherever you go. Begin to pedal your feet, lift your heels, move your hips. Taking a deep breath in, heels rise, exhaling, heels come down. Stay in Downward Facing Dog for another breath. On the inhale, let the right leg rise high. Draw the gaze forward. Foot comes through the hands. Rise up into lunge. Let the hands come down to the leg. Gently press the muscles of the thigh towards the knee, that front shin parallel to that wall in front of you. Raise the back leg up to meet the sky. Take a deep breath here. Arms rise. From here, five lunges. Drop the knee down and lift. Have I not commanded you? Be strong and courageous. Do not be discouraged. Do not be afraid. For the Lord your God is with you wherever you go. Two more lunges. Go ahead and take that right hand to the small of your back, left arm across, find a gentle twist. And stay here for two breaths. As you're ready, release. Come into a back bend in that lunge. And exhaling, bring hands to either side of the foot. Bring the front foot to the back, find plank. Have I not commanded you? Down to the mat. 
Be strong and courageous. Upward facing dog. Do not be discouraged. Downward dog. Do not be afraid. For the Lord your God is with you wherever you go. On the next inhale, left leg rises high. Gaze comes forward, foot comes all the way through the hands, rise into lunge. Find the lunge and let the hands come down to the thigh. So again, just gently nudge the muscles forward towards the knee, that knee right over the ankle, back thigh lifts to the sky, shoulders draw back over hips, arms rise up, five lunges here. Have I not commanded you? Be strong and courageous. Do not be discouraged. Do not be afraid. For the Lord your God is with you wherever you go. One more. And exhale, hands down to either side of the foot. Go ahead and bring the back foot to the front. Meet me in plank. Stay in plank for a breath. And come down to the mat. Connect with your scripture verse. Upward facing dog. Downward facing dog. Stay here for two more breaths. On the next inhale, right leg rises high. Gaze comes forward, foot comes all the way through. Rise up into lunge, pivot to warrior two. Come in and out of warrior two, that front foot aligned with the instep in the back. And stay in warrior two and bring the hands to, um, as if you were holding onto suspenders. And then push the hands out to the side. Reach the fingers towards the wall. Rotate palms up, slight external rotation of the shoulders. Maybe the front shin comes a little closer to the front edge of the mat. Sweep back, peaceful warrior. All the way forward, side angle bend. Come back to Peaceful Warrior, stay here. Raise that back arm up, anchor in through the abdominals, stay here. Have I not commanded you? Be strong and courageous. Do not be afraid, do not be discouraged. For the Lord your God goes with you wherever you go. Forward into that side angle bend one more time. Sweep back, peaceful warrior, cartwheel all the way over, hands to either side of the foot. Pivot the back foot. Back foot comes up to meet the front. Forward fold, bend the knees. Lift and lower the hips a few times. Engage through the abdominals, let the head come down, back of the head towards the mat. Hands to shins, rise up halfway. Exhale down. Pressing through the feet, come all the way up. Hands to heart. Inhale. Have I not commanded you? Exhale down. Be strong and courageous. Find your plank. Do not be afraid to the mat. Do not be discouraged. Find your back bend. For the Lord your God is with you. Downward facing dog, wherever you go. Breathe.
On the next inhale, left leg rises high. Gaze comes forward, foot comes all the way through, rise up into your lunge and pivot into your warrior and come in and out of warrior a couple of times. And as you're ready, find that strong warrior. So again, that front knee right over the ankle, don't let it drift forward. Pressing through the outside edges of the back foot, hands in as if you had suspenders and push out. Palms down, reach for the edges of the mat. Palms up, rotate shoulders back. Peaceful warrior. Side angle bend. One more time each. And this time, when you come into peaceful warrior, stay there. And consider bringing that back arm up just like you're holding a giant beach ball. And gaze comes up. Have I not commanded you? Be strong and courageous. Do not be afraid. Do not be discouraged. For the Lord your God goes with you wherever you go. Come forward into side angle bend. One more time back, peaceful warrior. Cartwheel all the way forward. Pivot, find your plank. Down to the mat. This time, stay all the way down at the mat. Curl the toes under. Five push-ups here. Have I not commanded you? Be strong and courageous. Do not be afraid. Do not be discouraged. For the Lord your God goes with you wherever you go. One more time. Meet me in downward facing dog. And find your breath. One more breath here. And that next inhale, come forward into plank. Draw knees down to the mat. Child to table. Stay in child for two breaths. And as you're ready, press into your hands and come up. Bring your feet forward. Begin to drop your hips side to side. Bring your feet to center, hands underneath the legs, find a seated cat and a seated cow. And finding boat pose, find the sitting bones, find the tailbone, find that space in between. Hands flat to the mat to help you out to support you a bit as you start. Go ahead and raise that right leg up, engage through the abdominals, lengthen through the spine. Extend the other leg low. Start here, maybe balance as those hands come forward. And maybe the right arm comes out to the side. And the left arm comes out to the side. Bring both legs up and sit up. Hands underneath the legs, cat to cow. Find that sweet spot in between the sitting bones and the tail bones. Hands behind for support. Left leg rises, knee bent. Extend the right leg low. Palms to the front. Stay here, find the work. 
If it's in the back, use the hands or bend the knees a little more. Should all be in the abdominals. Left hand comes out. Right hand comes out. Extend the legs. And sit up. Cat to cow. One more time. This time, start with both knees bent. Again, find that space underneath you, anchor in, extend the arms. So we've been working hard. It hasn't been long, but it's been hard. So if there's a little shaking here, be kind to yourself. Can you find the work in the abdominals? Right arm comes out, left arm out both arms out, and sit up, cat to cow. Good job. As you're ready, come down to the mat. On the mat, knees bent. Hands to your side. Come in and out of a bridge twice. So here, you're using the quadriceps to do the lifting. And then come up into bridge and begin to use the glutes. So tighten the glutes up. Press into that right foot. Feel that right hamstring kick in as the, you imagine the heel coming towards the hands. Extend that left leg. Crunch up with the glute and come down four more times. Have I not commanded you? Be strong and courageous. Do not be discouraged. Do not be afraid. For the Lord your God goes with you wherever you go. One more time, hold it for a breath. Bring that other foot down. Gently come out of it. All the way down to the mat. Stay there for a breath. Inhale up. Press into that left foot. Tighten the glute. Imagine the heel reaching towards the fingers and extend the right leg. Go ahead and contract through the glute, lift and release. Have I not commanded you? Be strong and courageous. Do not be afraid. Do not be discouraged. For the Lord your God is with you wherever you go. One more time, hold it up. Take a breath. Bring the foot down and release. Stay here for a breath. One more for the abs. Back is pressed into the mat. Float the right foot up half an inch off the mat. Keep the back in neutral, engage through the abdominals. Bring the left foot up. Float the hands on the mat. Don't hold your breath. Can you say the scripture? Have I not commanded you? Be strong and courageous. Do not be discouraged. Do not be afraid. For the Lord your God is with you wherever you go. Let those feet come down. Extend long, fingers to one wall, toes to the other. And come back, we're gonna do that one more time. Neutral position of the spine, anchor in as much as you possibly can with the abs. So use the bandhas, draw the pelvis in, engage the abdominals, navel in and up towards the spine. A little bit of a contraction at the base of your throat. Left leg rises half an inch, right leg, half an inch. Breathe through it. Say the scripture verse out loud on your own. Good 
Let the feet come to the mat. Extend the legs long, extend the arms long. Gently bring the knees in, give yourself a hug and rock side to side. As you're ready, hands to knees, gently push the knees away and in, back and forth here. And bring the feet down and extend into Shavasana. And relax your body and surrender as you trust our strong and faithful God. He prepares the way ahead of us. His ways are higher than our own. He commands armies of angels. The battle is the Lord's. Be strong and courageous. Do not be discouraged. Do not be afraid, for the Lord your God is with you wherever you go. If you can stay here longer, do so. But if you need to get going today, go ahead and begin to bring movement back to fingers and toes, wrists and ankles, turning your head side to side, bringing arms overhead and stretching fingers to one wall and toes to the other. And draw your knees in and roll over onto your side, eyes still closed, stay there for a breath. And pressing into your hands, rise up to a sitting position. Check in body, mind, and soul. Taking a deep breath in, arms rise, palms together, exhaling, hands to heart. Join me in prayer. Holy God, today we humbly come before you praying for boldness, courage, and strength. Help us to trust you as we move into uncharted territory, as we move into new experiences. God, we thank you that you are always with us. It is in the name of Jesus the Christ that we pray. Amen. Thank you for sharing your practice with me today.